uh, Frank and Mario with us now to talk about this big FA Cup game coming up between Borough and Chelsea. They are quaking in their boots because what we just saw was Manchester United getting beaten on penalties. Then Borough only had to take Tottenham Hotspur to extra time. They managed to get it done there. So it looks as though it's going to be done in 90 minutes this time around when they come up against right. Premier League opposition yeah, right. <laughs> once again. Uh, guys, our producer is calling this the FC Derby. And Mario, in case you didn't know, I'm a little bit of a Middlesbrough fan. A little? <laughs> what? <laughs> My hometown is where I grew up. Uh, but guys, I want to talk to you about who's going to start for Chelsea because one of the big talking points has been Romelu Lukaku in recent recent games, particularly because he's been on the bench for six of the last seven games for Chelsea, but the one game that he did start was the FA Cup game that got them to this one, and he did score the winner in that. So do you think that he'll start this one, Mario? I think oh, this is a very difficult one because Kay Avert is the one that makes the team tick, you know, at the moment. And I think Tuchel is just picking him because he's looking at the overall picture. But this will be a perfect game to allow Lukaku to play and give him the opportunity because if not you really are breaking him down like his confidence must be you know like regardless of it's a big guy he knows he has enough experience but still strikers they are just totally different than than uh, now you, you mentioned frank and myself because you know as defenders you know and as it as defenders we were different we we could come into the game you could leave us on the bench for a couple of games and then put us in but as a striker they are so much built on intuition so, no. Yeah, I, I hope he's going to play because it will help his confidence. And if not, because, you know, if yes, he's going to play, he needs to take that opportunity because if not, it's going to be a very tough journey for him. Do you think Tuchel should start him, Frank? Uh, I guess he's the only one who could answer to that. He's uh, every day, you know, week in, week out, working with Lukaku, seeing him in the dressing room, seeing him behaving. And, um, and, and if, is Luk if, if Lukaku's mentality is there, he will play. I think he will play. He will rest a little bit average and, uh, and Lukaku will play. If he feels that he's completely down, I think he won't take the risk. He needs to go through. He needs to respect Middlesbrough and uh, he's going gonna, he's gonna to need to build uh, his lineup with the best player that he has. Of course, there is a psychological aspect on the lineup that he has to make for, for, for tomorrow. And again, if Lukaku is up for it, is, if he's ready to fight, I think he's going to play. Otherwise, Tuchel won't take the risk. Mario, what do you think has gone wrong for him at Chelsea? I think it's, it's the way Chelsea plays. You know, like um, Havert is the one that is more uh, agile. The way he plays, he sees, um, he's not as physical as Lukaku. Lukaku is a physical guy. And I think tactically, he picked it up so much that he plays his back to the goal so much. And Kay is always trying, Havert, he's always trying to face the opponent's goal. Because that is where his strength is, you know. Coming from Germany, it was always a player that has to be was built on intelligence and seeing where his opportunities were. This is what he's taking now, and I think that's why Chelsea changed his way of playing. While Lukaku, I feel like he's so set in the tactic of Tuchel that he sometimes forgets his own game because his own game is actually facing the opponent's home. So that's why I'm waiting to see how he's going to pick up his chances now. Uh, these are the odds for it. Chelsea come into this as the away team, but they are the big favourites coming into it. Obviously, Middlesbrough Championship opposition, mm. Chelsea, mm. Premier League. They are David and Goliath clash, you could say. Stevie's laughing at me when I say that Borough might get that done in 19 minutes. Why? Well, the game will be done in 19. I don't, know, I don't <laughs> think like Borough to get it done, though. How do you see it going, Stevie? Yeah, I think Chelsea's got too much. I, I absolutely think Lukaku has to play because if, if Lukaku doesn't start in this game, as Mario said, you'll destroy him. And the truth is, the Champions League and making sure you're in the top four in the Premier League is more important to Tuchel and Chelsea. And you can't keep throwing Havertz out there. You've got to look after him. So, unfortunately, even though Lukaku will start, I don't see your beloved Middlesbrough getting anything after 90 minutes. Thanks, Stevie. I thought that, you know, with them being a team that plays in red, you might have been in favour of them, seeing as though these guys are clearly going to go against me. Let's get your prediction then. No, what, have you got, have you got, I wasn't listening. Have you got a score prediction? Chelsea, three. Middlesbrough, nil. I can't believe you, Stevie. LA. Middlesbrough, one. <laughs> Chelsea, three. <laughs> uh, guys, you think it's going to be a, a big win for Chelsea? What about you, Mario? I go with Ali's score, 3-1. I give them yeah, a goal. Huh? I give you a goal, okay? 
I give Thank you. you. <laughs> I appreciate it. You can come back oh, onto FC. <laughs> uh, Frank. <laughs> You know me, Kay, I play many times against Middlesbrough and I'm, oh, I always won and I, my heart will be completely with the Blues, so no chance for Middlesbrough. Lax TV, 3-0. Sorry about that. It's all right. Chris, Wild, Chris Wilder said I'll that promotion's it. a priority anyway, so, you know, maybe I, the semi-final. I don't know. Do you, Do you agree with it? Hey, I don't, I don't know why Frank had to remind us that he had, he had played Middlesbrough <laughs> many times and won every time. Thank you, Frank. Well, and he's a World Cup winner, let's not forget. Just to a hurt K. Just to hurt K. This weekend for on the ESPN+. Plus. Uh, Borough against Chelsea on Saturday, and then on Sunday it's a triple header. Palace taking on Everton, Southampton against Man City, and Nottingham Forest against Liverpool. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN FC on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and of course, ESPN FC seven days a week, subscribe to ESPN+.